How to connect Wix website to Google Analytics. Hello everyone, in this video I'm going to be quickly showing you on how you can create a Google Analytic data stream through Wix. Now we're going to be using Google Analytics for the latest analytic website and here we're going to add a data stream for Wix really easily. So you're going to want to make sure that your Wix website is obviously uh, live. You're going to copy its link from the home page over here. Once you do that, you're going to come to Google Analytics. You're going to go into your admin. Once you're in your admin, you're going to come here where it says data streams and you're going to go into your data streams. From here, you're going to go to web and you're going to go into add stream. You're going to go on web. You're going to click on yes. Here, you're simply going to go ahead and paste your data stream. So you're going to see if it's in HTTP or HTTPS. Mine is in HTTPS. So I'm going to add that and move the HTTPS. And once you do that, you're going to name your website. So my website is called Coder Tech. Once you do that, you're going to click on create stream. It's going to verify if the stream is correct. And uh, as we can see, it gives us a stream ID, gives us the stream URL measurement ID and everything. And once all of that is done and good to go, you're going to go through the installation instructions that it gives you because for most websites, data collection is not active. So you can simply go ahead and install it manually. So what you're going to do is the Google tag. You're going to copy paste it in the code of every page of your website immediately after the head element. So I'm going to go ahead and copy this. Once you copy this, you're obviously going to go into your website's designer. And uh, if there is an edit code option, you are going to do that. So in Wix's case, if you want to connect it to your coder tag, what you're simply going to want to do, go straight into the editor. Once you go straight into the editor, you're going to want to make sure that uh, the uh, editorial sequence or the coding sequence works efficiently, works properly. So here, when things are loaded up, as you can see, you have different options to add. So make sure to add it in every page as they stated. All right. So to add it in every page, what you're going to want to do is you're going to go into add elements. You're going to go into embed code. And once you go into embed code, you're going to go into custom elements. You're going to add it to your site. And once you add it to your site, obviously you're going to want to make sure to add the custom elements. Obviously you're going to want to make sure you have a premium plan, but you're simply going to add this tag to every page. It's going to be a blank tag. Okay. You're not going to see anything. It's just a code that analytics need. And once you do that, that will connect your Wix to Google analytics in the easiest way. And that's pretty much about it. So thank you for watching until the end and I'll see all of you in the next video. Goodbye.